Welcome to the Transy Sports Network, wrapping up a fantastic and historical weekend for Transylvania women's golf. We're joined by the newly crowned HEAC Coach of the Year for Women's Golf, Tyrus York, leading the Pioneers to a team championship and uh, affording a lot of players, four of them to be exact, on the all HEAC team and also producing for the second straight year the individual champion and league MVP and junior Meredith Moyer. Congratulations on all those accolades, which seemingly took too much time to list off, but uh, what a weekend for you and your pioneers, Tyrus. Oh yeah, it was a great weekend. And, uh, just, you know, it's hard to say how proud I am of, of these girls. I mean, they've, they've worked really hard all summer long, um, and they came in this fall ready to go. I think one of our, our best, I think still our best uh, score so far this year is our first qualifying round, and we got really close to it again this weekend. So it's good to kind of start strong, and then now we're finishing strong. And, we got a lot to look forward to. Speaking of great showings, this team put together that record score of 310 yesterday. It wasn't just one star doing it, it wasn't just two, it was this entire team getting the job done and having really good showings on the course. To what do you attribute that and what is it like having them all put that together in up to this point, the biggest event of the year? Well, we've seen all of them at one point in time have these rounds and it was just a matter of time before they all started to do it together. Uh, you know, golf being an individual sport, there's really no rhyme or reason for that sometimes. And, uh, you know, we're fortunate that it kind of clicked when it needed to because, you know, even though that I think at the end we started to pull away, it, it was a really close tournament throughout. And uh, if you'd have told me a year ago that we would have shot these scores, I, I probably would have slept a lot better last night, but I didn't. <laughs> so, um, you know, I, I'm, I'm relieved that, it, that it's over, but I, I'm really proud of it. What do you make of Meredith's performance, given the way she started? She was obviously in the thick of things, uh, but the way she just gradually worked her way back in this tournament in the second round and then finishing things off in that very dramatic one-hole playoff um, and then eventually became two. What do you say about her performance and her way to just battle back into things again and again? Her, her passion on the golf course is unmatched by anyone. And sometimes that, that can get her in trouble and sometimes that can make her look maybe not in the best life, but she always keeps her composure uh, when she has to. Passion is something that you, know, you just you have to have if you're gonna never give up out there. And she's had several times throughout this season where she could have given up and she never did. And uh, we've seen her you know, in our home tournament when we had the preview. She shoots like 80 in the first round and comes back and shoots a three under 70 in the second round. I mean, that's just almost unheard of to, to flip it that quickly in that short amount of time. So uh, you know, I, I'm extremely proud of her for hanging in there. Uh, she stayed patient today and, and got it done when she had to. Speaking of being able to flip things in a short amount of time, it hasn't even been two years since you officially arrived here on campus to become the latest head coach of the Transylvania women's golf team. Of course, with that team championship being achieved here today, you've clinched you and your team the automatic bid to the NCAA Women's Golf Championships next spring at Howie in the Hills. A very amazing achievement, an exciting time to think about. Um, how did this team put it together so quickly and develop and get it done to clinch this bid in such a short amount of time? Well, it really helps when you have players. And uh, you know, we were fortunate that some, some student athletes decided they wanted to, to play their college golf here at Transylvania. And, uh, it kind of came together much quicker and, and in a way that I never thought it, it really would. But um, you know, it, it's here, they're here, and you know, hopefully we're going to have a, an intact team with this top five next year and with any incoming freshmen that we get that could, uh, could challenge them. So, that challenge is what we need and hopefully we'll get it.